All right, let's finish this game. Let's just get it over with. Let's let's finish Call of Cthulhu and never never talk about it ever again. I have a walkthrough open. We should be able to finish it tonight. I hope. I hope. All right, let's see. Um I think last time didn't we didn't we stop last time in the in the prison cell? I think we got captured and then I think that's where we left it. I'm also going to still put this on the Halloween playlist, even though this is after Halloween. So if you're watching that playlist, Halloween's over. I'm going to do the same thing with Clock Tower whenever I get around to finishing that. Okay. Uh, yeah, this game has been a fucking nightmare. It's been a nightmare. Uh, but yeah, we just got captured. I didn't say, I just, I just got here. Uh, we just got captured and put in a jail cell. I'm assuming we don't have any of our weapons. Uh, yeah, we're, we're getting to the end of the game, though. This should be the last stream of it. Okay. It's just an old chisel. <laughs> what? Who said that? Hey. <laughs> I can't really even look through this door because I can't get close enough to the wall. I didn't say any- I'm not saying anything! There has to be something I can break. I'm not- I'm not looking at the walkthrough quite yet. Can I... chisel through- There seems to be a sewage tunnel running- Let's see if you can use the chisel to- Yeah, there you go. I'm sure the dude right outside the door won't hear you doing this, Jack. <laughs> Why don't you just look inside and see that I'm escaping? Yeah, I think we're like Let's see how close the game says we are to the end 81. That's not true. I think we're closer than 81 I'm sure that includes all of the secret levels and stuff that we haven't done. You know all the secrets that this game has Okay, can I whoa Hello Wait, what do you mean that's it? Are you going to break in? <gasps> Ooh. He's coming in. Ooh. Oh no. Oh wow, they really hurt this I don't dude. Want to disturb him again. <laughs> Is he crying? Is it okay to submit Smash stuff as art? I mean, I guess, as long as it's like drawn and it's somewhat stream related, sure. But as a general rule of thumb, I ask that art be stream related. Um, I, so this door's gotta be, oh shit. Huh. Yeah, I think we have to go stealthy at this point. We don't have any weapons or anything. It won't budge. Actually, because I know I'm gonna get caught and I don't wanna watch all of that shit again, I'm gonna go save again. I'm just future-proofing. Oh, can I not get <laughs> It doesn't let you climb back into your cell. Why? I just want to use the save point! Oh... It doesn't let you go back. It do well, I guess we're gonna have to watch that fucking cutscene again. After I get caught. Because there's no save point in this cell. With this guy. See, this acts as a ladder. You can climb this. It still says you're playing Kingdom Hearts. Oh, did I forget to change it? I thought I changed it. Oh, I didn't change it. You're right. Yeah, that would be kind of a shock if you wanted to watch Kingdom Hearts and you watch this instead. Of Cthulhu. How is the new Call of Cthulhu game, by the way? Because that's come out since the last time I streamed this. I always forget to change it to Call of Cthulhu. I think because I wish deep down that I wasn't playing this. It's okay. Well, okay is a hell of a lot better than this one. It's better than this. The door's bolted shut. That really isn't saying anything. Seems interesting, but clunky. 
Okay, let me rephrase the question. How is the new Call of Cthulhu game in comparison to Call of Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth? I think that... Oh. Is it tell it's telling the same story or what? Oh, I'm gonna get seen. Can you go back that way? Can you go back that way? I want Can you go back that way? Excuse me. Excuse me. It's a different story. Oh, okay. Alright. I'm kind of glad about that. Because I, I just played through this, and I feel like next year I want to stream the other Call of Cthulhu, or the new one, and I don't want to play through Innsmouth again. I've had it with Innsmouth. It has like a 63 on Metacritic, if that means anything. Ugh. What does this game have on Metacritic? Oh, well, what am I supposed to do? All right, so basically... <gasps> oh no. <laughs> did they just, did they just not check inside of this little tunnel? This game has a 76. There is no justice in this world. There's no justice in this world. None. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm in the tunnel, right? Just look. I can, I'm making, like, eye contact with you right now. <laughs> can you just... I fucking hate stealth sections in, in non-stealth games. What the hell is this? What the hell is that? It looks like a feeding hatch. Well, what am I supposed to do with that? <gasps> oh. Alright, let me, uh... Ooh! Hold on, I'm gonna look at the walkthrough. Because I want to know exactly where I'm going. Did I close the walkthrough? I closed the walkthrough. There we go. Uh, let's just control F chisel. Whoops. Chisel. Um, crawl into the adjoining cell. D -d 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 -d. Okay. When he's gone, sneaky time. Sneak out of the cell and follow the wall on your left. All right. Well, I think I went to the right. You'll see a boarded section of the wall with an opening at the bottom. Crawl into the opening. Don't worry about exploring the rest of the prison. Okay. Um... All right, well, I think I went the wrong way, so. Uh. Can I just, can I just, can I just? I would really, can you just not? I would say it would be faster to just load my save point, but we're gonna have to watch the fucking cutscene again, because I didn't save after. Yeah, that's good. That's great. That's wonderful. This is wonderful. All right, we're going to run. Sir Kabune, thank you very much for the sub. Uh, fucking God. Okay. Can we... Maybe I should just run. No, you don't. All right, let's... Fuck, let's just... Oh, there's no sprint button. There's no sprint button. Of course, I forgot. What game am I playing? Call of Cthulhu, Dark Corners of the Earth. There's no run button. <laughs> No, you didn't. Did you just say you lost me? Did I just... Oh, oh fuck. <laughs> How did I manage this? <laughs> How did I not take any damage? Can I please use the same point? Maybe I just wasn't grabbing the wall. Oh. You guys, are you just incapable of, of seeing, like, I don't know, <laughs> holes in the ground? Clearly, I went in here. I really just need to take a left out of this cell. Uh, 
Am I- is something wrong with the game? Because I'm not taking any damage, and I feel like I should have been hit several times by now. I wouldn't complain about it, but... Can, uh, how am I supposed to do this when they won't leave? <laughs> Can we just... God, these voices are so funny. Alright, I'm gonna run. I'm gonna make a run for it again. Oh no, well... <laughs> got killed immediately. Oh boy. It's gonna be one of those nights. <sighs> now I gotta wait for this dude to come in and punch him. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Any second. Maybe I could sneak out while he's... No. They must have had so much fun making these voices. I would have had a great time making these voices. No one. No one. Did you already see me? Uh, this fucking segment sucks. He's gonna see me. Alright, we need to take a left and find some boarded up entryway. Can I- how do you make him leave? I need him to leave. I can't sneak by him like this. I like distract him? Oh wait, he might be walking. I hear footsteps. I hear fin steps. This? Oh, that's my cell. Oh, I'm gonna get caught. Uh can we just fuck. Nothing of interest. No, it was that was something of interest, Jack Walters. It was ammo. Ugh. He's just gonna come back. How am I supposed to sneak past them if those are his two points he goes to? If his two points are here and there, how am I? Hmm. Okay, go back. I'll try to move past you. All right. Just stay facing that way, though. How am I... I can't go back in there. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. Maybe if I go into... Nope. All right. Can you crawl in there? Is that where I have to... Oh, fucking God. How are you supposed to do this? What's the problem in chat? I can see chat. Um, okay, all right, got it. It won't budge. I really dislike this segment. Asterio, thank you very much for the sub. All right. Okay. It really just would be nice if I could go back and save at this point. I just don't understand how they reasonably expect you to sneak by this dude to go to the left. It <laughs> All right, hold on. Oh, well, I don't want to do that. How do you... Am I sure it says to go to the left? I, at this point, I really would like to just not finish this game, but it's it's too late. I have to finish it. And now, for some reason, alt-tabbing isn't working. There we go. Um, 
Sneak out of the cell and follow the wall on your left, avoiding the guards. You'll see a boarded up section of wall with an opening at the bottom. Crawl into the opening. How? 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 Guide, how am I supposed to crawl to the left? Unless I have to go... Unless they got confused and they thought that right was left. It won't open. It won't budge. I am crawling, so if there's anything that, like... Maybe if I just wait here, he'll, he'll turn around and he won't see me. Come on. Ugh. I can't crawl in there. Ugh. Fuck. All right, I'm gonna have to go all the way around. I don't know why the guide is saying to go to the left, but I'm gonna try going to the right. I don't know. All right, I'll just wait down here for him to do this again for like the fifth time. Go ahead. Then shut the door and I think he just sits outside the door for a couple seconds. Did you hear that they changed some of the Brawl Victory themes in Ultimate? Yes, I did. Uh, still not crazy about them, though. I don't know. I still think that the, the Victory themes they added in Smash 4 didn't sound good. And, Nothing I don't mean, I haven't heard the ones in Ultimate very clearly, but... I don't know, it sounds like they don't use real instruments or whatever for the Victory themes anymore. Especially, like, the Punch-Out Victory theme just didn't... It wasn't good to me. I don't know. Um... Let's just go this way then. All right, maybe I can go in here. The door is bolted shut. I wonder if the the guide just did mean right when it said left. Because this way is possible. I can go this way. What is this little area? It's too fucking dark to see. I'm still moving. No, I'm not. Okay. Maybe that's it. Well, this is the boarded up. Hold on. Maybe this is where I was supposed to go the whole time. Um, no, this can't be it. All right, let's keep going this way. Don't you turn around. That must be the boarded up spot right there. Oh, fucking. That's it. Ah! <laughs> I made it though. Fuck. Ugh. God. That's where I gotta go though. Maybe I can just duck and weave my way there. Maybe I can sneak out behind this dude and then just swerve and do my zigzag technique. Why aren't you? Maybe you have to be a certain way up the ladder before he comes in. Come on. Come on. What? What is he? What? All right, go. Go. Just fucking run it. Run it. Zigzag. Zigzag. Oh, look at that! Oh, that's all you need to do. All right, guide. What next? I'm following your your instructions. Uh, if you uh, in your refuge is a save point, move to your left, and you will see a door above you. Okay. Stand, hop up on the ledge, and crawl through the opening. Don't go through the door; it leads back to the prison. Well, that sounds. Awful, but okay. No. 
Don't you open that door. Uh-oh. Keep sneaking up the hill, it says. That hill or this hill? So maybe we'll try this one first, because I'm here already. What did I miss? Uh, not a whole lot in Call of Cthulhu. I did start streaming Kingdom Hearts 2 tonight, and it was a very good time. Very funny. Um, that should be a really good stream. Definitely more high energy and entertaining than this one, for sure. Um, but in terms of Call of Cthulhu, you really haven't missed much. Okay. Did they see me? That sounded like they just said something. What? I think he saw me. No. Yeah, he definitely just said, don't let him get away. They know where I am. Oh. I wonder if this is where I go. I should really be looking at the guide. What is this? It's locked. God damn it. Hmm. Looks like some... It's locked. There's like some fucking plant thing in there. Uh. Alright, well, I don't have... Alright, let me check the walkthrough again. We're just gonna do this by the books. Um, sneak behind the guards at the campfire. Keep clinging to the left wall. That's what I did. You'll come to another path that leads down to the campfire. Keep sneaking uphill. Watch for a fish man farther up. Uh, hurry after him and sneak up the hill behind him. Alright, so there's a guard that I actually have to follow. If you get spotted, run to the arch. All right, so I think we just need to keep headed up, if anything. Oh, fuck. They already saw me. That, is that the arch I have to go to? Wait, did they, they turned around. I think that might be where I have to go. Cause this is locked. Unless, can I crawl through here? It won't budge. Can I use this? Nope. All right. Well, then maybe we just got to drop down here. Oh, boy. This is going to kill me. I did save. So. All right. I thought maybe I could do, like, the oblivion thing where you kind of cling to the wall to avoid taking fall damage. We didn't lose too much progress. All right. No. Let's just cling to the left wall. Okay. Now what? I need to figure out where I need to go from here so I don't hit a dead end. It's just all these patrolling guards are fucking obnoxious. I need to keep headed. Are you going to do the Mo Mc Ronald McDonald strat? You mean holding your left hand on the wall like they did in Ronald McDonald Wacky Adventures animated shorts? I would, but this doesn't seem to be a traditional maze. I don't think the Ronald McDonald technique would work very well here. Um, maybe I have to go up that way. Mm, it looks like that's still a sharp drop. How the hell do you get to that archway without dropping? Oh, wait. It's that path. I have to take that path. Why would anyone subject themselves to that- to those tapes? I don't know. Morbid curiosity. To see Sunday with their own eyes. Okay. Yeah, I gotta get I gotta get up that path right there. <laughs> Fuck this. No. Stop! I fucking hate Call of Cthulhu, and I hate when games take away your guns. Okay, come on, come on. That's it. This is where we gotta go. Unless this is where I came from. It's not. This is where we gotta go. Go, 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 go. Alright, what is this now? Do we really need to physically see Sunday? 
You do. I think everyone needs to see Sunday at least once. I don't think you have to see him for very long. I don't think it needs to be an extended viewing of Sunday. But I feel like Sunday is humanity's greatest mistake. And I think that as members of the human species, we should all have to look at it. At least once. Oh, that's super fucking fantastic. <sighs> Fuck this game. Still no Sunday puppet updates. I really wish you would get some more Sunday puppet updates. Nowhere. No one. No one. I really just want to try to fucking swoosh through this area, but I don't think it's going to happen. This place is too wide open. It's too open. It's like... If I can sneak by those first two dudes, I might be able to do this. Hmm. If I could just, like, run through this area, that would be just swell. Did you just say fuck? You're not supposed to say that, fish man. Alright, let me take the left and see if I can make it to there from this way. Maybe I could just sneak down that path. Fuck, I lost them. I never heard an old band on... I, if they have been saying fuck this whole time, I don't think I recall the fishmen saying it. Okay, um... Fuck! Well, now I've gone the wrong way, and I don't... That's the banner. That's, it's up there. Oh, could you just move? Could you just move, please? Just go down that way. Could you just go down that way, please? Ugh. This fucking game. <laughs> There's no way to get there from here. There's no way. I want my gun back. Okay. Just stop. Just stop. What are you doing? Stop. Why is he walking all the way up here? Alright. Can I just sneak by him? Please, like, look off the cliff edge. Don't turn to the left. Turn to the... Ooh, is that another one? Okay, alright. Fortress, thank you for the sub. Alright, now we just gotta fucking avoid Ugh. skip skip I feel like finishing this game is a rite of passage it's something I'm going to be able to brag about for the rest of my life even though I've already done it once technically why of all games on earth would I choose to complete this one twice why why would I do this I forgot how, how much I didn't like it I wonder if this is the wrong way and this is just going to lead me back to hell. Um, Alright, uh... Oh, jeez. Why? I didn't do anything wrong! Stop! Why are you afraid? I hate this game. <laughs> I hate this. How close am I to the... I'm not going to be able to finish this tonight. Are you kidding me? I just scrolled down the walkthrough. There's no way. There's going to be another stream after this. I fucking hate this. Just let it end. No, shut up. Isn't this the final chapter? Yeah, but it looks like it goes on for ages, and the fact that I'm taking forever to get through these stealth segments just doesn't bode well. I'm already at the very end. I can't stop now. Ugh. 
<laughs> all, right, all right, kill me. Just do it. Or don't. Or don't. Yeah, there's no way to get down there without fucking breaking your legs. And I'm already damaged, so... And I can't break through here. <laughs> Fuck. Alright, maybe what we should do is we should alternate between trying to fucking speed through it and actually taking our time. So this time we'll go slow and we'll try to sneak it. The last time when we went this way, it actually worked and we made it decently far. So let's just do that again. We go up this way, then we're going to get to that guard and we got to follow behind him. Now that's the dude we gotta end up following, right there. He's gonna stay there for a bit. Okay. Yeah, I feel like had this game been made later and they tried to take a more like amnesia approach to it rather than giving everyone fucking machine guns, I think it would have been a lot better. I mean, not even... Amnesia's like a stealth game too, but that game's kind of built around it. This one just sort of feels like they, they throw in stealth segments. Unfair stealth segments all the time. Alright, turn. Turn. Like, these... They should have focused on making these dudes scary and threatening. Rather than just, like, fucking goofy. So this is the part I can't get past. What does the guide say about the... Alright, let's see. Um, okay, follow the path. There's a small opening in the left wall. Crawl into it. Keep going... Uh, keep this location in mind. It's a great place to hide from enemies. Once you get a gun, you can hide in here and pick off... Okay, well... <sighs> crawl along the edge of the tunnel. You'll see fishmen patrolling the area. Wait for the coast to be clear and then crawl out. Keeping to the left... Keep... Yeah, all right. Well, keeping to the left seems to be what we have to keep doing. Uh, God... Let's just keep going. This must be the spot they were talking about to pick off enemies right here. Once we get a gun. Which who knows when that will be. We have like a shitload of ammo though, so that's good. All right, can you guys just go? Is there one that... Is there one up there too? Yep. How am I supposed to sneak through this? That dude's going to be a problem. Can I sneak around like this? Alright, uh... alright, 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 alright. Okay, that's good. What? No, 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 no. No one. Don't shoot. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. What the fuck is this place? Should 
be in the clear here. What is this? What the fuck was that? A peculiar blue plant. Oh, you're just gonna pick that up with no comment, Jack? After everything you fucking- you just babble on about everything you pick up, you're just gonna grab it? Alright. You know what that thing looked like was one of the level up fruits from Cameo? Remember that game? Alright, this must be the right way. This must be! I would like another save point! I would like another save point! Uh, oh, thank you. Oh! Aya Cthulhu, Aya Dagon, let's fucking go. Alright, now that we're at this save point... First, let's see statistics. 81% still, that's wrong, it's lying to me. Okay, let's look at the walkthrough again. Uh, there's a small hole. The book of the crawl through. Follow the tunnel to a T intersection with a save point to the left. Look around and you'll see a green crystal glowing within reach. When you see it, uh, use your chisel on it, and then it says you won't be able to lose. All right, well let's try to grab the green crystal with the chisel. It won't budge. Yeah, but what if we use the chisel? The chisel alone won't be enough to loosen the crystal. All right, so then what does the walkthrough say to do? Um, if you follow the cave to the waterfall chamber, carefully work your way down the pool at the bottom. You will find two caves leading to the pool area. One with a med kit. This is so complicated. You can't get past the starfish segment, so leave this tunnel alone for now. Take the other tunnel, and it will wind up at a T intersection. Go left. You will find revolver ammo. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We're gonna finish this. I'm never gonna finish this. I'm never gonna finish this. I think that the the moral of this walkthrough so far is just whenever there's like any sort of crossroads, it always tells you to just keep left. Shiniz, thank you very much for the sub. Um, God, can I make this jump? <laughs> It said work your way down to the bottom of the waterfall chamber, which I'm doing. No problem. There ain't even no fishmen in here. And there's a health kit. Okay, so it said there's a crossroads. One of them has a health kit, and one of them has starfish. And you don't want to go to the starfish, so go to the health kit. Go this way. Is this, this isn't the starfish path, right? Oh, it is the starfish path. And it said I can't... I can't get past the starfish right now, so I shouldn't go that way. Uh, maybe this way. I'm sorry, I gotta read the walkthrough again. I think I do. Unless, hold on. Yeah, this is where I came from. Unless that's where I came- hold on. Hold on, let me see. Okay, uh, you'll find two caves leading to the pool- uh, leaving the pool area. The one with the med kit in front of it leads to a pool of water and then a lot of starfish. You can't get past the starfish, so leave this tunnel alone. Take the other tunnel, and it will wind up at a T intersection. Go left to find revolver ammo. All right, so other tunnel would be this one. Go up here. Then there should be a T intersection, and we take the left. If we find ammo, that means we're going the right way. I think this is still right. I think. C could you just make it up the ledge, please? All right. Take the left. Please be revolver ammo. There we go. Okay, so this is it. This is where the walkthrough is telling me to go. And a save point! Ho ho ho, we're making it. Air-filled tunnel. We're still in air-filled tunnel. See, the walkthrough says we should be in, like, a different area. It says we're in, like, a different save point. And our completion should keep going up. Please, 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 please. 
If there were no subtitles, I would not understand a word they're saying. Excellent. Dismissed. <laughs> That's Robert Marsh. He's become a fucking Palpatine fishman. What the hell do you think you're doing, Robert? What the hell do you think you're doing, Robert? And you've got our order singing hymns? You're a fool, Sebastian. I command the order of Dagon. Do you think they named Sebastian after the crab? Because it's like an ocean thing? Probably. I've shut the lab down, Sebastian. What? What? Can't you see how far this has come? Your trivial experiments are of no concern to me. All energies must be directed at completing the translation of the tablets. The work of my great grandfather must be finished. Uh huh. Take your worthless body back to shore. You are of no further use to the order. Oh. That's not going to happen, Robert. It's not going to happen, Rick. Oh, shit. Oh, he is Palpatine! <laughs> well, it's more of a Vader thing, but... <laughs> Still, close enough. Oh, what, Jack? You're a dumbass, stupid fool. What was your whole body on that grate? It's not safe. There's no time for that right now. It's I don't safe. <laughs> I don't have any weapons. Books and ancient manuscripts gets locked. This is finished. It is our Maybe he pulled time. Jack Most down. All right. Like, let's explain it that way. Let's give the game the benefit of the doubt and say that he pulled Jack down. Why am I not taking damage? Okay, there we go. I just took some damage there. Not oh, now. Didn't I've got to get this bastard off my tail first? Oh, there's a knife. Mother what what button is the knife? Okay. Ooh. Didn't one of these guys have a gun? Yeah. Where's Sebastian's gun? Where is it? Sebastian's body just disappeared. Where is? <laughs> where's no stop I don't know where Sebastian's gun went just heal up real quick yeah this dude really isn't killing you very fast maybe he should be carrying a gun there's no fucking gun it disappeared I can't even tell if I'm hitting him Wow, his corpse just disappeared before it even hit the ground. There we go. What? What do you have there? A knife. No! I've got enough problems without experimenting with witchcraft. What about the ammo? Books oh, you just don't want it? Okay. I recognize some of the symbols from the Book of Dagon. Since I killed the king of the fish people, I think I should become the king of the fish people. That's how it works. All right, let me read the walkthrough again. Uh, there's a knife on the desk. Take the knife and ready it. Keep the desk chair between you and Marsh, blah, 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 blah. Be quick because his slap is very painful. All right. Well, it actually wasn't. He he wasn't that tough. On the desk is a briefcase. Open it and take the key. There are also shotgun shells. By the window are two pistol clips. Among the shelves are down lower pistol, revolver, ammo, and a med kit. Did I get the med kit? I think I did during the fight, right? Yeah, there's no more med kit down here. All right. Now what? Uh, leave by the fancy door. Follow the path up to the great hall. Sorcerers guard the wall to the left along with patrolling fishmen. Crawl to the right. The room with the Cthulhu statue has some sort of rifle bullets or some rifle bullets. Okay. So go up here to the right. What was your reaction to Diablo Immobile? I don't know what that is. I don't follow Diablo at all in the slightest.
Okay, so there should be rifle stuff in here. Diablo's getting a mobile game and everyone's very pissed about it or pissy about it. There's a Diablo mobile game and people are pissed. Is it like in instead of a proper Diablo game or what? It's an ancient statue of Cthulhu. I'm giving him a nose. He looks beautiful. Well, didn't you say something about a rifle in that room? The room of the Cthulhu statue has some rifle bullets. Keep going down the stairs and you will find a rifle and a... Oh, thank God. Apparently, they hyped up a Diablo announcement for the end of BlizzCon, and then it was a mobile game. Yeah, that kind of sucks. I probably would have been mad, too. All right, I can't read that. Okay. But yeah, if you want me to, like, talk in depth about it, unfortunately, I don't know a single thing about Diablo, so I couldn't tell you anything. When someone asked if there would be a PC port, the rep responded, don't you guys have phones? <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. All right, so now that I have the rifle, it's clobbering time. Don't you guys have phones is the worst thing to come out of it. I, is that like a cliff somewhere? Okay, sorcerer. See you, sorcerer. See, I like to see your magic wand protect you from this. All right. Well, now that I have the rifle... Uh... Don't stay by the door too long, or the chanting will drain your sam samity. Uh, hard, uh, head upstairs, shooting any fishmen that get in your way. This long hallway has lots of cover for you to hide behind. Okay. Maybe we will finish this tonight. The path ends at an ornate door with a bolt and two holes in the wall next to it. All right, well, let's just get to that first. Yeah, it sounds like what they did at Bethesda's E3 conference, except after they announced Elder Scrolls Blades, they, they announced Elder Scrolls VI. From what it sounds like, they did that, but without the Elder Scrolls VI part. Chambo, thank you for the sub. The door is bolted All right, shut. so now, well, we made it here pretty fast. I was expecting that to take longer. Can I just unbolt it? The door is bolted Can shut. That was it? Oh. Hello. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Who? All right. Well, now that we're through that door, which way do you want me to go walk through? I'm sure this is bothering some people, but I want to get through this game f with whatever means necessary. Um, go straight ahead, down the ramp to a small room with a med kit, then go out and to the left across the ledge to the prison. You may notice deep ones patrolling the cliffs. Uh, lure them to the ledge. Okay. Well, let's just let's just keep going until I get stuck. said we have to end up back at the prison anyway. Well, hold on. This is back... Well, that is back to the prison. Let me just check out this room again real quick. Because it said something about a health kit. Wait, where are you? Where? You up... Oh, shit. Ah! Oh, no. Oh, shit!
No, you're not. It's just I have a different save. What? No, 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 no. I skipped the cutscene at least, I think. No really? I thought I had a save after that. I really thought I did. Where's my fucking... What button is the knife? Oh, there we go. Why is he... I really thought I found another save point after that, but I guess not. Nothing of interest. It is our time now. You had your chance. You now it's our turn. Humans had their chance. Alright, I got the key. Fucking god. I really could swear to god I got a save point after this. But I guess not. All right. Oh, hey, let's just not go that way. Nope. Oh boy. Man, oh man. Door drives you insane, so you don't want to stand near the door. Go straight through here to the fucking bolted up door. Got him. Got him. Got him. Ho oh, ho ho! Look at you, Jack. Alright, so basically. The d I'm Dagon. I wish I could backtrack and save, but the save point the was above the fucking shut. vent. The door is bolted Unbolt shut. Unbolt it! I hate how he says that. Oh, look at this. I can kill him through here. I like that the bolt mechanism they use for the doors down here, despite these doors looking like eldritch Cthulhu doors, they still use like standard bolting mechanisms that look like the exact same model as the ones up in the above world. Serious, thanks for the sub. Oh, oh, well, I'm dead. Maybe not. Where are you? Where are you? All right, I don't think I want to go back up there. Let me just double check. Uh, then go out to the left across the ledge and towards the prison. All right, so that's where I have to go. You may notice the patrolling deep ones. Uh, lure them back to the ledge with the hole in the wall and then hop in and shoot all. Okay, so that's, that's just a, a tip for taking care of them. Back out towards the prison, follow the right-hand wall, and then up. You'll come to a cave ending in a door to a laboratory, with the, with, uh, which opens with the keys you took from Marsh's briefcase. All right. So we got to go back into that, like, tall room. I'll need to decipher it. What does it say? It's some kind of warning message. Well, I don't think I need to go in there. Did you ever do that Mookie 2 stream? Mookie Takes Manhattan? No, I can't find Mookie Takes Manhattan. I would like to stream it, but I cannot find it anywhere on the internet. I've looked. I think I do have to go this way, maybe. Mookie Tookie. That's what they should have called it. Is this the right way? Let me save at least. Thank God.
I'd ha I don't think I even have my old physical disc anymore. Oh, that's cool. I like. I took damage from that. <laughs> Wait, no, I don't want to be here. All right, we just saved. Let's just load our save point. This is near the end, right? I fucking hope so, dude. I really, really do. Ugh. Wait, this just leads me back here. How do I get back to the fucking, uh, prisons? I came from this way. I should have to climb back up here, right? Maybe? I don't remember. Because this will just lead me back there, too. Unless, can I get this crystal now with anything? I'll need some. I don't I have... I can't get yeah. the force behind the chisel to break it out. Never mind. Maybe this isn't the right way. I really thought it was, but I was going to... Didn't take damage. I thought this was the right way, but it might not be. Shit. Oh! Do it again. Get us back to where we were. <sighs> Checking the walkthrough again. Um, follow the right hand wall down and then up. You'll come to a cave ending in a door to the laboratory. What? Well, I don't know how to get back to that area. I think I've gone and gotten myself lost. I could swear I needed to go up around this point, but no, this just leads back out to that room, and I'm, like, already at the top of the chasm. Unless there's a way out of here that leads back to the prison. But I didn't think that was the case. Unless it's that way. Maybe it's up there. Uh, I don't think it's that way. Is this back to the prison? Maybe? Yeah. Yeah, 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 wait. I think... I think this leads back. Yeah, because that's the campfire. Okay. We should be making it. We're making it back. I don't quite know what I have to do back at the prison. I guess we'll consult the walkthrough when we get there. That's good. Uh-oh. I've alerted the deep ones. That's what the walkthrough said would happen. Oh, that's a big one! Oh, those are big deep ones. Isn't the, is this the the hole that the guide said to hide in, so I could kill them easy? <laughs> Come on in, fellas. Come on. Oh, all right. Oh, now what? Ah, the funny hole. <laughs> Uh-oh. All right, well, now that we're back in the prison area... No, I'm trying to shoot this dude! Oh, that was cool. Now, where do I go? Okay, uh... Follow the right-hand wall down, then up. You'll come to a cave. Alright, so I think we went the wrong way. Pock would fit well into Lovecraft. You think he would? I feel like the the whole minigame with the, the, the keeper, was it? Who is coming to check the animals? It won't budge. I think that he would fit well into Lovecraft it's lore. Locked. All right. Well, I can't go back into that save point. The door is bolted shut. One of these doors must open with a laboratory key. Oh. The door is bolted shut. Not anymore. It's not. What is this? Whoa! Jack! Alright. 
Jack's a fucking badass. Did you see what he's just done? Is this the laboratory? It won't open. What about the key? Maybe this? No, that's where I came from. Alright, follow the right wall. These are the it cells I fudge. came out of. Nope, nothing of interest. It's not this. The door's bolted sh shut. Unless, is this it? What is this? It's back in the room with the bonfire. Oh shit, really? I don't want to go in there again. I'd like to save again, but all right. I'm gonna have to feed something to that monster because there's like a feedy hole. To the left and up. Over here? Let's see. It did say towards the prison area. It didn't say in the prison area. It's gotta be somewhere in here. Uh, is this it? Uh oh. Could barely see him. Nope. Uh, I don't think this is it. Wait, what is that noise? Maybe this is it. Hmm. Huh! Looks like some kind of laboratory. Yep. Ooh. Hi. All right, we made it to the laboratory. All right, walk through. What do we do now? Oh, brilliance! Thank you for the sub. Uh. Take the med kit, rifle bullets, lab notes, green bottle of weed killer. I bet I feed the weed killer to that stupid monster. There's a lot of shit to... Oh no, I just scrolled down too far. Alright, there we go. Let's just look around first. Make sure we get everything. I've never seen plant life like this before. Can we shut this? I'd feel safer if we could shut that. Weed killer. Uh, that's the flower we got. Uh, if I do stream the new Call of Cthulhu game, I'll probably do it next Halloween. I think I've had my fill of, of Cthulhu for they a while. be trying to cultivate new breeds of plant life. Yeah. Oh. Cursed! Uh, I'm cursed with this vile plague! Oh, shit. Please, stranger! <laughs> I beg you, put me out of this misery! I need your help. I, need to <laughs> I don't think he's any position to help. Only those loyal to the order have access to them. It looks like his jeans melded to his foot. But there's an old passage. A passage that runs deep beneath the temple. Though I warn you now, outsider, tread cautiously. Uh, I've heard talk of <laughs> ancient dwellers <coughs> playing in those dark depths. <coughs> He's being overtaken and by the genes! From the forgotten time. This just keeps getting better. So how do I get down there? Explore the abandoned areas. <coughs> that is all I can tell you. Now, please, kill me and my pain. Is this like a moral choice? Kill me! Look at his fucking jeans become his foot. No, I think I'm gonna just leave. Put me out of this misery. What does the walkthrough say to do? He tells you about an old passage deep beneath the temple. He asks you to kill him. It appears that killing him causes sanity loss, but leaving him alive may also. What do you mean? You're the guide. You know, there's no uncertainty here. All right, well, if I do it from far away, do you think I'll still get the sanity loss? Maybe if I just... Where am I going? I want to get a cool distance shot. No sanity loss here. See, that was the smart thing to do. 
That way you don't have to see it. Alright, so have I gotten everything I needed in here? Just don't look at them now. Most of these experiments, this must have been where they were developing the contagion. Must be. This must supply power to the light. I can't think of anything else other than they were developing the contagion here, Jack. I'm gonna save over this one too. Alright, uh, I think we've got everything we need in here. So, uh, let me just make sure. Take the med kit, rifle, bullets, lab notes. I think I took the lab notes. Green bottle of weed killer and avail yourself of the save point. Uh, the other side of the room contains pistol ammo, Tommy gun ammo, and a guy strapped to a table. Uh, the back door takes you to the prison along with its supply of patrolling guards. There was a back door? When you enter the prison proper, you can go left towards a hanging animal carcass or right. Clearly the upper level of the prison. You will, over you will come to a side passage with a large, pl large plant growing up the wall. Take the med kit and use the weed killer on the roots of the plant. You can now climb the plants to reach the room with the alien gate. But since you don't have a green gem, you won't be able to activate the gate. Holy shit. All right. So we got to go back to the prison proper now. Oh. That's the back door. And I just... Let me just... I just saved. I don't need to save again. Of course, alien gate. Ugh. Meat carcass. Maybe I have to put poison in the meat. I must have to feed... I have to feed that creature somehow. I think I have to poison it so I can explore the room he's in. That's my guess. That's not even the walkthrough talking. What is this? Oh, I don't know what the fuck I just picked up. What did I get? Prison food. It's m malodorous slop. Yuck. With just Y-U-K. Yuck. Is this the plants? Uh, it said something about plants that I need to kill. Nothing of interest here. This? Didn't I just? Buddy, thank you for the sub. Oh. Unless they were on the upper level. It won't open. Hold on. All right. So, basically, a monkey. Uh, let's see. Let's see. What's over here? Oh, here's some vines. Bingo. Ah. Uh, There's some peculiar veg. Well, let's use the poison spray. Station here. It doesn't look safe. Yeah, that'll work. I'm sure ordinary weed killer will work on this eldritch plant. Bingo. That little spot of gardening seems to have worked. Yep. Okay, well now I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. Whew. Can I climb this? Oh, shit. Hello? Oh, this is what I need the green gem for. Holy moly. It doesn't work. Isn't this like from the beginning of the game? I've seen a room similar to this somewhere before. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This looks familiar. I've seen machinery like this somewhere before. All right. Uh but since that's the alien gate, so you don't have the green gem, you won't be able to activate it. From the room with the now dead weeds, continue around the upper uh, area. You'll pass revolver ammo. You'll also pass a barred window overlooking a cell where you can spot a hammer on the floor. Once you've cleared the upper reaches of the prison, head back down and go down the spiral ramp in the center. You'll find a pack containing all of your weapons. Oh, that's what I found. That was the pack and a bucket of slop. Unbolt the door and exit, killing any fishmen. Yeah, 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 yeah. In this circular hall, you'll find shotgun shells, Thompson ammo, blah, 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 blah. Tell me what to do with the slop. Um, 
Nearby, you'll find a metal wall with a small handle. Hungry pounding... Hungry pounding comes from the other side. Open the feeding panel and use the prison slop. I don't have to poison it or anything? Alright. Well, I know where to, I, I was going to do that anyway. Hungry pounding. Alright, how do I climb down? I'm... Jack, can you... I'm going to fucking take fall damage here and die. Because Jack's not cooperating. This is music. This is weird. Alright, let's find... That hatch and feed him the slop. Prison slop. Prison slop. Break your leg, Jack. Yeah, you're all right. Oh, look at that bone. Oof. Oof! Go ahead and fix that right up. Thank you for hungry pounding ASMR, but here's your slop. Oh, looks great. Uh, can I poison it? It's poisonous when ingested. Bingo! Eat up! Wow, it looks, looks so real. Love that. Love that. That's great. I don't think the door's bolted shut. I don't think the door's bolted shut? The door's bolted shut. I think I just merged two lines together. There we go. He poisoned. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry that I poisoned you. Hammer. Now I can get this the green gem. Could come in useful. The green gem! Guys! All right, now the green gem, I think the fastest way to get there would be through the lab, if I'm not mistaken. There's playing, there's playing some fucking alien music right now. You're gonna play the remake after this. Someone asked about that earlier. Um, first, I don't think it's a remake. I think it's a different Cthulhu game. Um, and second, I will play it, but probably not till Halloween next year. Like I said, I've had my fill of this fucking mythos for a very long time. Alright, let's... I can't believe all of that was just to get a hammer. I feel like Jack could have used a rock or something to help him chisel that crystal out. I don't know why he needed a hammer, but alright. I think this is the right way. We just gotta go back up. I think we gotta go through the arch again, right? Or the knife, or something, I don't know. He has a lot. He could have used the gun. His fists. His teeth. Just bite the gem. Your dentist isn't even gonna know, Jack. I just tried to quick save. Not gonna work. Where is the green gem at? Is it this way? I don't think it was this way, was it? Ugh. I don't think so. Oh man, the frame rate's getting shitty. That happens at some times with this game though, and it does it just goes away on its own. Oh, this was the office. This game's frame rate is all over the place. It, it's been happening since the start. Like, it randomly just dips for no reason, and then it, it'll go back up all on its own. For seemingly no reason. It doesn't even seem to be, like, area-based. I mean, it's still playable. It's just kind of annoying. What about this door? It won't budge. All right. I just gotta find whatever that fucking green crystal room. I should have just followed the walkthrough. Instead, I was like, oh, I can find it. Nope. Go out here. Uh, don't think it was that way. Probably just not optimized well. Well, yeah. 
that and I'm also running it through external software to get it run when to get it running in windowed mode because this game natively doesn't have windowed mode so there's a lot of things that might be causing that but who knows who knows we're almost done oh, I missed this health kit are you not gonna pick up the health kit Jack can I uh, peek through the wall to like maybe see through the level geometry and see where we're going That'd be swell. Maybe this way. Wait. This is this cave. Where's the ca I'm going towards a different cave. This isn't the right way. <sighs> Where was the fucking green crystal room? Please. I feel like I bumped into it a million times, and now the, the when I want to find it, I can't find it. I'm just going in circles. Let me check this. Uh... Okay, leave the lab by the opposite door. Follow the left-hand wall, sneaking down the ramp all the way to the brightly lit arch with the two flags. Take this passage straight through the cavern where you found the blue plant. Okay, crawl through the hole to the caverns with the waterfall at the first intersect. Oh, it's at the bottom of the waterfall cavern. That's right. That's where it is. That's where it is. It's at the bottom of that place. I know I know where it is now. I just need to get back to the waterfall, which I think is over here, please. This is the fruit cave. So then I crawl through this hole to get to the waterfall cave, right? Right? Waterfall cave? Please be the waterfall cave, please. Oh, even better. It's the green cave. The green crystal cave. Ha <laughs> ha. Give me, give me the crystal. That's not even attached to the fucking wall. It's, it's hovering. That should do the trick. Please. Why, why do you need this crystal? I mean, I guess you need it to power the alien gate, but I don't know, Jack. I just don't know with you. Okay. Now, we have to go back to the prison, climb up the vines, and then, then we should get to the alien gate, and then I think we're done with this area, at least. Oh man, the music's getting more and more ominous. Holy shit. Ooh! Oh, fuck! I just saved, so it's okay, but... Oh, Jack, come on. This is the wrong way. Oh, fuck! He's a biggin'. Whew. Okay. That was like a super fishman. All right, we're almost there. Almost there. I hope this is the end of the game. That would be sick. All right. Oh no, it's happening again. Whoa! Where did you come from? I gotta find that plant room. No, that wasn't the plant room. <gasps> there he is again. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> Look at the way they fucking run. Plant room was on. Was it on the? It was on the top floor, I think. I might have to go through the lab. Oh shit! Ooh. Where is?
is the plant room. It's not this way, is it? Nope, that's the lab. The music stopped, so I think they might be dead. Or gone for now, at least. There it is. All right. Okay. We made it. It looks like something has been removed. Yeah, but not this, right? Oh. It's too hot to touch. It's being used as a power source for the machine. Touch. Aliens. Aliens. There we go. A portal to the alien world has opened. Come, my brothers. Do I go in? <laughs> what? What is that? Is that a fucking chain gun? Where, where is it? <laughs> what? <laughs> Don't recall this. Don't recall this at all. Oh, that looks good. That doesn't look like a fucking square they plastered on the fucking wall. What is this? This is just the gravity gun. How does it work? Oh, I was really expecting that to blow up and kill me. Does it have infinite ammo? It might just be a... Oh! Ho oh ho! Alright, what is this telling me to do? Uh... Uh, continue the laboratory. In the alien gate area, use the green gem. Go through it. Right in front of you is an alien energy weapon. You may need to crouch to pick it up. Get out of the water and practice using the weapon. It has infinite ammo. A quick pull of the trigger is enough to kill a deep one, which is especially sus susceptible to it. That's the only type of enemy in the game, so I feel like... Okay. Press and hold the trigger. Blah, 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 blah. If you shoot the water, it electrifies the water. This will come in handy against the starfish in the cavern. At the base of the waterfall. No. Ahead of you is a save point. Waterfall source. Okay. Follow the stream to the waterfall to find a med kit. All right. So we're going the wrong way, I think. I think we're just supposed to go past the save point. So like this way. Let me just save again. Just to be, just to be sure. Oh. Wait a minute. It's too dangerous. I need to find another way out. Okay. Well, hold on. Didn't we... Where did that alien gate take us? Is this the same caves? Are we, like, in a different dimension now? I don't understand. Huh. Alright, well, all we know is we need to get to the bottom of the waterfall to kill a bunch of starfish. Wait, where the fuck are we? Oh. You said a quick click would be enough to kill them. Having no aiming reticle is kind of annoying, but okay. What is this area? It's not important. Well, there could, could be. Alright, so let's get to the waterfall cavern. Which I think means we just gotta head down. The furnishings here seem temporary. Am I in a different area? I think I might be. Man, that's all the way on eight. <laughs> Not having a fucking crosshair sucks. There we go. Oh, shit. Uh... Oh! Got him. Uh-oh. Alright, we're almost at the waterfall. Let's go. Wait, hold on. Wasn't the... Was the starfish chamber in here? Oh! Oh, that was cool! No, it wasn't. It was through there, I think.
Yeah, I feel like no crosshair might be a good trade-off for infinite ammo. That's a good point. All right, so the starfish chamber has to be around here somewhere because we're at the bottom of the waterfall. I love how we needed to find an energy gun to get through the fucking starfish chamber. All right, where is it, bro? Oh, wait, we're not at the bottom of the waterfall. It's down here. Oh! Yeah, as far as weapon designs go, this thing's pretty alright. Can't complain about it. Alright, so... Is this where the starfish is? Ha ha! Is the problem. There we go. Got rid of the starfish, even the ones that weren't sitting in the water. Now where do we go? Man, they're playing some like that whatever that old alien instrument is. They're using it. <laughs> Good loading screen. Ugh. Please just save me from this never-ending nightmare. What does the game say I'm ah! What does the game say I'm at now? in terms of percentage. 87. Okay. Ooh, those footsteps? Footprints? Well, this looks like the right way to go. I'll walk it off, you big baby. All right. Why does everything hurt this dude? This game asks you to do a lot of platforming and he like takes damage from fucking everything. Oh jeez. Uh oh, oh fuck, this is disorienting. Oh, Jack's, like, controls are all fucked up. <laughs> I can barely tell what the fuck I'm doing! <laughs> Where do I go? Where do I go? I can climb that. Oh. I'll never make it out of here. Those things blowing me around. <laughs> what? Holy shit! Look at it! Oh, that's a cool fucking monster! That's a cool mon- oh, there's more than one- I'm dead, but... Cool monster. Alright, well, I just tried to heal. They're killing me by yelling at me. Oh. That's going to be a pain in the ass to redo. Does the guide have any advice for that part? Any advice for me, guide? Uh, watch your step as you traverse this. This area, you'll find a med kit, save point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where I am right now. You're about to face a very tough fight. I found it easier to fight from the far end of the bridge. Make sure you have energy weapon out and hurry across the bridge. At the far end, crouch so the two stone columns are to your right and so the slope is to your left. This is important because you will be attacked from both sides and the slope will protect your flank. The winds go crazy and huge floating polyps will glide toward you. Tackle one on the right first, trust, uh, trusting to the slope to protect you from the other one. All right. Let's try that. I don't know, we'll give it a try. This is the right way. This isn't the right way. The thing collapsed behind me. We're in too deep at this point. We gotta finish this. Alright. Do 
have full health? I have full health. I love how I took damage from that. Now, when this dude said the bridge, was he talking about this? Because I don't think I can just stand on this. I think I have to at least make it to the other side of the platform. He said the two columns. Yeah, right here, I think, is where he wants me to be. Oh, fuck. I can't see shit. This is super disorienting. This is so fucking disorienting! Is that one? I can't even see! Yeah, that's one of them. Okay, I think I'm doing decently. Is that one dead? What? That didn't hit it. What? 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 Okay, that one's gone. Good death animation. Alright, where's the other one? Oh, shit. It's right there. <laughs> Look at that thing. Am I killing it? How fucking much health does this have? I think I hit that one. I don't- I can't tell if it died or not. Nope. All right, that one's dead, for sure. No way he's coming back. Where is it? Where is it? Where'd it go? Where is it? Ooh. You better not be the one I already killed, buddy. These things better just be teleporting around. Yeah, he's just teleporting. I think. I hope. Oh! <laughs> it's so gross! Oh, that's a terrible spot for him to spawn. Oh, fuck. Come on, 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 This is sort of satisfying building up power with this thing and unleashing it. Where is it? Where is it? I did it. I did it. The little side mouth they had was pretty cool. I liked those things. That was kind of a neat section. Good job, Call of Cthulhu. Good job. Let's tally up the points of cool things this game does. And that is one. No, there's some cool moments in this game. It does a few things well. I will say, the very beginning, the atmosphere is still good before you get the gun, like when you're exploring, uh, fucking Innsmouth. Oh, what's up, Desert? You just missed the boss fight against the twin beasts. I wonder what those things were called. They were called the polyps in the guide. They were big fetuses. With two mouths. Each. Not collectively, because it wouldn't be weird for them to have two mouths if there were two organisms. Four mouths, total. I think we're getting to the end of this game. 
which I'm just so happy about. I'm so happy. I'm so ready to be done with this fucking game. Do I still have my gun? Where's my energy weapon? There we are. That's the good shit. All right. Uh, health's still good. And a save point. Everything is coming up, Jack. I've also been using a walkthrough tonight just because I want to get done with this. So, we can do it. What is this area now? Ooh. <laughs> this music. It's written in some kind of ancient well, language. then decipher it. You have the book. I can now read some of the last passages. I'll write them down. All right. Good. Good job, Jack. What is this? It's a shrine for worship. Well, thank you for answering my question, Jack. I mean, there's probably hidden items over there, but let's just walk in here. A gong? Perhaps I should gong it? Alright, well, I don't know if that did anything. I will consult the walkthrough shortly. I just want to kind of look around a little bit on my own. <gasps> Koopa Wizards! Oh, I got them both in one shot. This weapon is great. Oh, who is that? Excuse me? No memory of this. Oh! <laughs> All right. <laughs> Do I have to kill it? <laughs> Is this what these dudes are worshipping? Oh, how do I kill it? It needs to be it needs to be destroyed. <laughs> has to be destroyed all right let's look at the guide uh all right all right you'll find the last med kit on a high ledge uh crawl out blah 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 head inside the temple the gong is important soon for now go upstairs and surprise the sorcerers in their evil worship okay Head back upstairs. Kill that big ugly in the bubble as it is a manifestation of Mother Hydra. All right, well, we need to do that. I don't think I can hit it from here. I skipped over some stuff in the guide. I want to see if I can figure it out on my own. Maybe I push this? Can I... This definitely is interactable, right? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> Got it. All right, now what? I don't know how to kill it. Okay. What the fuck? Is that me? I'm not standing there. Maybe it wants me to stand here. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> See, this is what I wish was in the whole game. I wish it was more shit like this. Also, that's a save point. What do I do? The pool is sealed tight. It's in like a, a bubble. How do I pop the bubble? Pop the bubble! Water electric gun. Oh shit, not a bad idea. Did that work? It looks like it should be working. It doesn't look like it's taking any damage, but the electricity's in there. Maybe I have to lift those up somehow. I have to lift up the other ones. 
How can I get those ones to lift up? Yeah, the fucking electric sound. Good shit. Um, God, I hate the fucking vision blur. The pool is sealed tight. Can I cut the ropes or something? Well, no, I need to lift... I need to... It must have something to do with those statues. The fire is lit on that one. Can I lit... Can I lit the fire on the other ones? There has to be a way to get the fire lit on those. Uh-oh. God, I love this. This is so fun. I love being able to see. Yeah, I have to lift these up. If I could release the water, then I might be able to flood the pool. Well, how do you want me to release the water, Jack? Hmm. God, look at that thing. That's fucking cool looking too. These pipes control the flow of What do I have for items? Nothing. Maybe it's got something to do with the gong. Maybe that? No. Let's see. Check behind the statues. How would I get up? Oh, can I get up there from here? I don't think so. This is the only way up as far as I can see. I don't think I can go behind. I don't think I can. Hmm. Yeah, it's pretty chill for a manifestation of a fucking eldritch deity. Not really doing much of anything. Does that do anything? Uh, all right, let me check the guide again. Right, let's check it. Uh, big, ugly, and bubbles of manifestation. Hydra, there are channels that lead to her. Your job is to release the water that feeds the channels, flooding her bubbles so you can shoot the water with your energy weapon. Doing it will be harder than it sounds. Turn around and go up the ramp to the center statue. There is a fish head lever behind the statue. I... I could swear I clicked on it, but this might be another one of those cases where it's like I didn't have my my character's vision perfectly centered on it. This? 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 Maybe it's like downstairs behind the statue? God, why is the vision like this? Oh. I'll need to do it. <laughs> Can you just decipher it then? With an ancient chant spoken by someone in possession of a sacred charm. Well, I don't have a sacred charm. What am I supposed to do? I'm pretty sure you already interacted with it. Oh, that might be That might be why this one's lifted up. Okay, well then, hold on. Um, there are other... Okay, let's see. There are other... The other four statues in the temple will take water from all the statues of Flood Hydra's bubble. But the statues are too high up for you to reach. Uh, if only you had the mighty legs of a frog. What? You might want to go back to the ventilation shaft occasionally to save. You need to hold down the jump button to get up the slope and then crouch to enter the tube. The save point is finicky, and it must be faced from the right side. All right. Uh... Okay. All right. Maybe we should go save again. I don't know. What's in there? said something about jumping up the slope. Why do I keep seeing this? This is so confusing, this whole section. Where the, where the fuck was the save point? <laughs> where was it again? This way? Was it in there? I don't even remember. 
These are the tablets of Dagon. This must be the original source. Ah. <sighs> Ventilation shaft occasionally to save. Well, the Step ventilation shaft is probably in here. The Book of Dagon. The Book of Dagon. I hate this voice actor. I'm not too fond of him either. Not like as a person, but I don't know if it was the voice direction he was given or what, but it, it's, <laughs> it can be really grating at times. Ugh. All right, let's just skip the saving. How do we get up there? You'll get flashes from Hydra's point of view of you standing in the pool in front of her bubble. The problem is when you do this, Jack says he can't concentrate and then the deep ones attack. You need to stop Hydra's mental assault so you can concentrate. This is where the gang comes in. The gong, <laughs> gang, gong. If you examine the gong, Jack says if you hit it with enough force, it would be deafening. Shoot the gong with a fully charged energy beam from close up and then run to the small pool in front of Hydra. Oh, so you need to deafen yourself. <laughs> okay. If, if, I, if I understand this correctly, you need to deafen yourself so you can concentrate while, like... Okay. Now I need to go up here. Yeah, that's that's a good idea. I'm sure this won't cause any permanent damage. All right. What do I do? Well, now I can hear again. But what the fuck? Am I playing as a as a deep one? <laughs> How do I jump? <laughs> I'm playing as one! <laughs> okay, I guess Jack can possess them? Did it work? It didn't seem to lift this up. I can't lift the cover. Maybe I didn't hit it right. I could swear I saw it move. Are you telling me I have to go down there and activate the gong every time? I don't think I did it right. No, it was working. But the thing didn't lift up. Oh, okay. You just need to crouch in front of her while deaf. Yeah, the lever moved. All right. Well, then we'll just, we'll just have to do it again. A few more times. This is the weirdest concept for something that a game is asking me to do you can't focus so in order to make it so nothing can distract you you need to deafen yourself first that's cool that makes sense all right let's get this one now how do you jump how do you oh i guess i was crouched <laughs> All right, I hit it. Come here. All right, let's head back down. Do it again. Oh. This is tedious as fuck. Cause I shouldn't be surprised at this point, but still. Alrighty. Can't move. Alright. Let's keep going, Jack. Let's fucking... This is just like what happened in Mario Odyssey with controlling frogs. Same thing. Capture the frog. Did we do... We did that one, so let's do this one. Can we get another one real quick? Nope. Of course. Of course you can't get two in one cycle. Of course you can't. One more. Ugh. <sighs> 
I know these things are coming for me. I never would have figured out how to do this had I not been looking at a guide. Alright, I think it's just the one to the far right I have to get now. Oh shit, there's more of them. Oh no. Come on. Come on, work, 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 work. Go, 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 go. Alright, that's all four. Uh oh. Alright, this should do it. Yes! Yes! Uh oh. Watch me die here. Okay. We did it. <laughs> we did it. Defeated. <laughs> All right. Well, now what do we do? Got it. Oh, can I save? I can. That is a. It is a save point. And now I got the crystal that I needed. Remember, he said you could only go through that door with the crystal, and I have the crystal now. Rest in peace. She's doing that one leg stretch from gym class. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to get through it. I have the charm. That charm. Behuin and Kugna, Fanu Naemna, Bagliz Kafungin, Kathava Hell, Kulth Kafulu Kafungni, I a Rigazengaro, I a Hydra. Alright. Huh. Fungin, huh? Yeah. I, uh, Fungin. What is that? Is that a fucking submarine? Oh, wait. This might be the escape sequence at the end that I was too sl- Alright, it seems like he's moving normal speed, doesn't it? Yeah, this is it. This is- okay. So when I played through this game way back when- my character was too slow to get through this part. I had full health, but he was too slow. I tried to get out of here a zillion times. I thought, I must be taking the wrong route. There must be somewhere I have to go. But then I looked it up, and apparently it's a common issue with this game where your character just doesn't have his movement speed set fast enough to get out alive. And I'm really hoping that doesn't happen again, but it seems like he's moving the right speed. It seems like he's moving the right speed, so let's hope that fucking we can get out of here. I, I swear to God, I was sitting here trying to do this for like two hours before I looked it up. And, uh... Yeah, that was apparently an issue, and I had to patch the game to fix it. But, I mean, it so far seems to be mo He seems to be moving normal speed, but I guess I would have thought that last time, too, so... That's gotta be the end right there, right? It looks like some Whoa, oh, okay, alright. Might have just lost some time there. Why would you go down here, Jack? I think I'm lost. I think I'm gonna lose, but I don't think it's because I'm moving too slow. I think it's because I don't know where I have to fucking go. Yeah, alright. Well, that's that. It would be it would be really nice if the camera wasn't fucking all over the place during this too. Maybe I do I have maybe I have to use that to open the gate. I don't know. Open the portal. Oh shit! The thing's right there! <laughs> I'm a fucking dumbass. All right, I know it's possible at least. Okay. 
That's cool. I've done this section so many times. I, I can do it again. Why not? Didn't see the thing. Co totally. Maybe. You know what? I'll give myself some. I'll, I'll give myself some slack here. The fucking camera is not all over it. the place. And we at least get to hear Jack say this again. So. To get through it without Behuin and Kugna, Fanu Naimna, Bagliz Kafungin. Yeah, Fungin, dude. Hell. Kulth Cthulhu Kafungni. I a Rigazengaro. I a Hydra. Alrighty. Ugh. Funk me pingy. Cthulhu Kafunk. <laughs> Did Lovecraft have his, like, a whole language made up? Or was he kind of just, like, how did he go about writing stuff like that? Was he just making up gibberish words, or did he have, like, an actual structure? Like a fictional language, like Klingon or something. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, fung. Oh, fungni. I can't fucking see! I feel like he must have had some idea of what he was writing. God, I can't... I can't handle this. I feel like I'm on a boat or something. I just pictured Jack, like, wobbling around like a fucking, like, Octodad wobbly character. Yeah, there was definitely something wrong last time I played this game. Oh, wait! Okay, I didn't make it that time. It's possible... Because I, I think I went full speed. We get to hear it again. It's possible that maybe I got hit by a boulder and it, it lowered my speed. Oh, boy. <laughs> Yo, you guys ready for some Kafungnin? Oh, there's subtitles this time. Gliz Kafungin, Kathava Hell, Kulth Cthulhu Kafungni, I a Rigazengaro, I a Hydra. That's a great ending. I a Rigazengaro. Love it. See, now I don't know. Hopefully, I'm still moving the same speed. What if I, like, what if I got injured in one of my lives and the speed stayed the same? Yeah, it felt like I that I died like halfway. It feels like I didn't have nearly as much time that time. I am hungry. Yeah, it felt like I didn't have nearly as much time. I hope that. <laughs> well, we're not making it this time. That's for sure. You guys ready for some more Rigazengaro? Yeah, I'm limping. I'm not even going to make this jump. <laughs> Just end it. DK64 moon jump. I, am I moving slower? I feel like I might be. I feel like I started moving slower. I don't know. Behuin and Kugna, Fanu Naimna. Bagliz Kafungin, Kathava Hell, Kulth Cthulhu Kafungni, I a Rigazengaro, I a Hydra. Am I? D is it? Does it look like that to you guys? Oh, I have the adrenaline shot. Let's take it. Oh, look how fast I'm moving. Oh, that's just gonna make it harder to see though. With fucking adrenaline too, this is gonna be impossible to see. I should have taken the adrenaline after the torpedo. Oh. I think you have to memorize where the rocks fall, too, so you don't take damage. Oh my god, what am I looking at? Oh, 
<laughs> what am I looking at? <laughs> I'm gonna fucking vomit. Oh my god. All right, well now we're moving pretty fast. Come on. Oh, now we're not moving too fast. I feel like we're moving pretty slow now. Come on, that's the end of the game. Th the thing I missed. I made it the first time. I was just a dumbass and didn't fucking see the, the crystal. Come on, Jack. Come on. Oh my god. This is where we died last time. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Activate the thing. Activate the thing, activate the thing. I think I'm gonna die. No, what are you doing? <laughs> Stop! Stop! Jack, how the? Oh my God, is he okay? What the hell happened to him? I think we beat the game. Check his pulse. Jack, can you hear me? Jack. Jack. I think he ends up in the insane asylum, right? Because of Kafungni. Oh. Yeah, we still have one more game left over from Halloween to finish being Clock Tower. So I'll probably try to knock that out tomorrow night or something. And uh, I'm putting this and that in the Halloween playlist still just so it's complete. But... Yeah. What is, what is, what am I looking at? What am I looking at? Am I like a, what is this? Is this like a Jack. great race of yith? Why have you summoned me? What? There is something I must show you. What? <laughs> we must hurry. Time is short. We're going. The Great Library. Am I a fucking... What the fuck is happening? A terrible conflict is upon us, and our hosts will not survive it. The keenest minds are already projecting to later days. Who will be the enemy? There have been no ructions with either the Migo in the north. Or Cthulhu's kin to the south. The what? The in what and the what? Did you come upon the vast steel trapdoors at the foundation of the old city? <laughs> what? Yes, but I didn't understand their purpose. There was a terrible war between us and a race of half polypus creatures that had been dominant until our arrival. Oh, okay. This volume tells of that bloody period. Oh. Uh huh. <laughs> okay. Why are you showing me this now? They are still down there, Jack. Thriving in the darkness. They are plotting. Plotting to break free of their bonds and wreak a terrible revenge. The end is inevitable. What? And close. Okay. Very close. Uh huh. How much time do we have? Yeah, in the what first the chapter we saw these things and then blanked out, right? So did Jack, like, become one of these things? Because he's got the same, like, he is one of them. Is 
that Jack? The, yeah, he, he hangs himself, right? We saw this at the beginning. Yeah, this is the beginning of the game. It's like poetry. It's like poetry rhymes. He's still traumatized over the girl from the very beginning, I think. I don't know. Jack basically ascended. Jack achieved Chim. That fucking door noise. Oh, I hate it. In the dark corners of the earth. Bravo. Mr. Walters? Oh, it's <laughs> Mr. Walters. Can you hear me? Mr. Walters? What? He's convulsing. We're losing him. What is that noise I'm hearing? Uh oh. How. how. I couldn't hear that. How, why was there subtitles for it? Oh, Jack had. Uh, oh, this was his suicide note. Now, at my end, I can fully see. My last case opened in me a new fear, a real fear, a fear of myself, of what I am, and w of what I have always been. All that I was is now lost. Hope, purpose, pleasure, all meaningless. I now walk in the shadows between worlds. <laughs> And it is there I have finally glimpsed upon what lives in the dark corners of the earth. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at this. Mythos rank, rank D. Percent complete, 93%. Time, 8 hours, 12 minutes, 44 seconds. Blood loss, heavy. Mental condition, clinically insane. Weapon accuracy, 57%. Shots fired, 957. Shots hit, 547. Enemy kills, 203. Headshots, 124. Saves made, 98. Drug abuse, casual. Congratulations, you have unlocked a new difficulty setting. Well done, you have achieved a new high score. <laughs> <laughs> what a great <laughs> what a great <laughs> final message <laughs> level nine let's go all right well that was uh that was call of cthulhu dark corners of the earth I am very glad we finished that, and I'm very glad we went on that journey, because it was it was awful a lot of the time, but it was like... <laughs> it was good. I, had a good. I mean, the game wasn't good, but it was a good stream. It was frustrating at times, but it was, uh... It was... It was funny, if anything. Um, but yeah, I decided to do this for Halloween this year. Finished it a little late, but we got it done, so... Thank you, Jesper Skoog. Um... But, yeah, that was Call of Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth. Would I recommend this game? Nope. I, pl I played it. You could just watch a stream of it or something, because I don't recommend it. Uh, I like the... Wait, Vice President of Bethesda is Todd Vaughn. That's the wrong Todd. Um, there's other games out there that cover similar subject matter that I think probably do this a lot better. I like the concept... But the execution was just not good. Uh, Femi, thanks for the sub. Yeah, I just, I think that it, had they tried to make a different kind of game, like I said, like a game that's more similar to Amnesia The Dark Descent with the same theme probably would have worked better. But, did it say Audio Gods with a Z? <laughs> Alright, well that was Call of Cthulhu. Uh, if you want to check it out, I think it's still on Steam, but... 
there's a new one that just came out, and maybe I'll do that next year. But thank you for watching the stream tonight. Uh, I'm currently doing playthroughs of... I just started Kingdom Hearts 2. I have to finish up Clock Tower, and then I've got other stuff in the pipeline because it's no longer Halloween. So we've got, you know, got uh, regular games coming up. Um, if you want to follow me on social media, you can do so on Twitter, at Mike Panutes. Like always, you can submit art there during the stream, and I'll show it at the end. If you want to catch up on streams you've missed, including all of the Call of Cthulhu streams and anything like that, you can check them out on YouTube by searching Panute's Archive. Um, what else? I think that's it. So let's take a look at the art, and then we will be done. Uh, okay, there's a few things. And there's a video, which I'll save for the end. Uh, this first thing is by Avocado4225. This is really cute. This is really cute. I love the art style of the, the one... Well, I like the art style of all of them, but the one given the little thumbs up is especially cute. That's really, really nice. Thank you very much. That's adorable. I really like these a lot. Uh, this one is... <laughs> this one's by Gilgamesh. Uh, this is, uh... A, uh... That's a, that's a drawing of a nobody from Kingdom Hearts 2. I think you really captured it very well. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty scary. That is pretty good. Uh, this is by <laughs> Dry Bones the God. <laughs> I don't quite understand why Goofy is a spirit. <laughs> but other than that, really nice. I like this art style very much. And it's, uh, the Donald's very good. Uh, this is Smash-related, but, I mean, I streamed the Direct, so I guess it's it's technically stream-related. It's Smash and JoJo. Uh. <laughs> That's pretty good. Pretty good. I like it. God, I'm gonna stream so much of Smash. It's not even funny. Everyone's gonna leave. They're gonna say, please stream something else. No! That's good. Thank you. Um. This is by Pecan Be Gone, VV Pinata. Look at that. Yesterday was what was your one year anniversary of starting Viva Pinata. Really? It was that long ago? Jesus. That's really cute though. I like that a lot. Thank you. Um This is by Cosmic Cat. Two things two little doodles this one and this one <laughs> why are they so goddamn big these are really cute thank you um very adorable uh oh shit this is cool this is by snail mail check out this fucking drawing of a of a nobody no body this is really nice i love the lines on this so much it looks so dramatic and intense this is super cool. Very, very nice. That's awesome. Thank you. Super neat. Uh, <laughs> this was what I saw in that Sora picture. And then Jake, Jack, Joe drew a few pictures. <laughs> and then uh, this also. Oh, yeah, I did. I showed the uh, I showed this the other day. So that's fucking. Yep. Yep. It's, I saw a clown nose. Um, okay, this is by... <laughs> this is by Miskel. <laughs> this is pretty good. This is pretty damn good. Pretty nice. Good sh... <laughs> That's nice. That's good stuff. Um... Oh, this is, this is really nice, too. This is by, uh... How do I say it? J.H. Billustration, I think? This is really cool. This is really, really clean. I like this very much. And this, too. <laughs> Good stuff. Good stuff. Thank you very much. That's adorable. Um, okay, and then there's a video, too, and I will leave you with that. Uh, it is by uh, The Geek. It says, made a short audio... Sh oh, it's an audio shit post. Might be a tad loud. Visuals are because I didn't have a good place to up... Okay, so it's just audio. 
but this is by the geek and it's a bit loud so keep that in mind i guess it's from the earthbound streams Remember the Amanda Schultz hold on let me get rid of the this music the geek with two eyes g-i-i-k Remember the Amanda Show blockbuster parody where. P. <laughs> I think I think the video is important for that. Hold on. Let me show the video because I think you say the video is not important, but I think the video is important. It was when I was trying to do the fucking uh, Earthbound glitch. Hold on. I think this is important. Remember the Amanda Show blockbuster parody where... P. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. Well, that's it for the stream. Thank you for watching tonight. Uh, should be back tomorrow night with more stuff. Probably starting a new game and finishing up Clock Tower, if I can. I don't know how much of that game I have left. But I'll talk to you later. Have a good one, and see you soon. Bye-bye.